Hello, this is Richard Gang from Microcubology, and I've just been printing the pieces of a new puzzle on the Mendel 90. This is a puzzle called Piff Paff with Turn by Gregory Benedetti. Um, an interesting puzzle because it's uh, four pieces that make up a 5x5x3 five by five by cuboid but the pieces are not printable on a RepRap printer because of the overhangs, unless you use support, which I don't like doing. So what I've done is used my lock block connectors, split each piece in half, so the pieces will look like that, and these printable connectors are designed to just push together I haven't tried these yet, so let's give it a, a go. It should be a tight friction fit. That sounded quite good. And it's also quite possible to put a little drop of uh, acetone on the inside faces that one's a little bit looser so I think I probably will do that but in general it's coming out pretty well. These, these um, inside faces are nice and sharp and clean so that once the two halves are pushed together it forms an almost invisible join which is what I was aiming for but it does also have to be a strong join because there will be some twisting force across this long bar and uh, I don't want any movement, there's just a little bit of movement there so I think um, a bit of acetone and then a, a G clamp to hold it shut while it dries will make that into a very strong piece um, I've no idea how to solve this puzzle yet, so I'm not even going to attempt it now. But um, I'm really pleased with the way that those four pieces have come out. And uh, once I've worked out how to fit them together, I'll uh, finish this video off. Well, that wasn't too hard. There we are, that's the finished puzzle. It's a lovely shape. Um, I think it will look even better with the uh, with the edges closed up and I might even try putting the whole thing in an acetone vapour bath just to give it a really smooth finish and hopefully given that um, the movements aren't too critical uh, it won't stop the fit from working. It took five hours to print um, but I think that's quite successful.